Pina gets uh, rid of it. And there's an easy try scored by Patrick Lambie. It had to happen. But to do that, Ndungani. No real chase either. Now here goes uh, Kankowski. First touch of the game for him. Gets it away to Mbobo. He's got pace. He's got Upland on his back. Kankowski. Good build up this by the Sharks and their number eight in particular. But Mbobo for a moment got away there from Upland. Now it's to Blanche. This is the beast. Over the 22, he drives it. McLeod, here comes to Blanche, doesn't get it, goes to Lambie. Nice little dummy by him. Oh, this could get in Springbok Palace tonight. I have no doubt of that. A fabulous try by the youngster. And he will send the young ladies around the ground into raptures. Well, he'll send all the fans in the ground into raptures as well. Frankly, they've fr thumped Western Province here this evening. That's it. Absolutely, and if you consider the, the effort they've put in for two weeks ago and today, and oh, this could round it off. We had the chance given Patrick Lambie has his second try of the match, and I would say there are two things with it a Springbok cap and man of the match. The, the box looking to repeat the feat of the first half. And Lua Tours got in there though and made a hash of it. But he's offside apparently. It looks a bit like a dockyard brawl at the moment. There are players all over the place. Okay, away to the far wing. And the kick tipped back and fouled. Yes, I reckon he's got it. Patrick Lambie. If he's got it, it'll be his first try in Test Rugby. Pretty cleverly done. Yes, right George, right. please, can you check if there is a forward by 15 when he got the ball in the air, please? Knock on. Check if there was a forward knock on or a forward pass. Oh, okay. Knock on, knock on. It's okay. a knock on he's looking for, absolutely. It's a perfectly no, weighted kick. 19 uh, again. It's just where the Jeff, yep. the, fo the player out there, LaRue, was it, who was coming uh, forward, whether he knocked it on. Piatel definitely got a hand on it. Absolutely. It's it's Kishner, Kishner, isn't it? All right, and check check as Look well. Look where he catches the ball. It looks as though that's the, uh, almost gone sideways. Green. The line, difficult to tell. Yeah, start in front. Entitled with his momentum to plant the ball. No problem yes. with that. Ball gathered by Stan and the Sharks straight back on to the front foot. Deep in province territory. Hold Marcel could sail with the carry. Back it comes for Lamby deep in the pocket. Out in front, he loves it. lamby has got three. Brilliant. No pressure on him whatsoever because of the depth. And he was straightened along and Sharks have possession again. That is the Western Province 22. Will they set something up for Pat Lambie again? Deep in the pocket. Keep the points ticking. It is coming back for Lambie. The drop goal is coming. He's watching anxiously and then turns. Brilliant! Much for the line again by Dyson McLeod. They're coming for Stan, you are probably trying to bump somebody off with low tackle, which is by uh, Matfield. Now it's Peter Steph to toy, holds off to see his junior Springbok teammate, Daiso. In the Nambi, offside. Now he can't go quickly, you see that? 60 or so. Cloud knocked it, you can't take it quickly. 60 on the side. Yeah. DPC driven by the toy. The cloud landed. Perilous point for the Sharks. That time he deserved great patience. Great ability to go through the phases. Real determination shown by a lot of the ball carriers. France Stein had to work particularly up. Scorer of the Springboks try from a mall in the first half. Here's Fanamava. Gaining a few precious meters. Hokart for Matfield this time. It's a bet with the clean. Hokart wants quick ball. He hasn't got it. Berger left to take up the scrum half duties. Reload, keep your feet. 
They got space up to the right. But some crucial time gained by the Wallabies to reset their defensive line here. Back it comes for Pat Lambie in the pocket. Kicks the drop goal. Get their nose in front. Well, the nose is in front, but for the Wallaby line out and claimed by Berger. Reinach and Yakane. Reinach again. Lambie. Beautiful break from Lambie. was also quite sad saying Scott Bigger was taking a bit of a dip. That's the reason he only gave a penalty. Patrick Lammy from 55 meters out to take the lead for South Africa. What drama. The crowd will tell you. Got it! Intense pressure. Patrick Lambie nails it. Well, he's only a little fella, Patrick Lambie, but he's got nerves of steel. When it went 20 all, England seemed to be taking over at the drive as well. But no, said South Africa. We want to keep this long run going against England, looking for the dozen undefeated today. 11 wins in that 12 if they register another victory here at Twickenham. England defending for their lives now, but they somehow have to steal it as well. Just over four minutes, Reinach. Replacement, Niyakane, Trevor Niyakane. Drop goal, back goes Lambie. Gets himself ready and delivers perfectly. That's the dagger. Yeah, and opening up to a Cheetah player. <laughs> Very solid scrum from both sides. And Timber with a pick up at the back. Beautiful offload for Rana. Looking for Lambie. The juggle, but he's got it and over. Brilliant try from the Sharks. Excellent work from 8, 9 and 10. The captain is in under the post. Well, I have to say, Terum Tembu, that's all your points, my friend. Well, Brian Abano is once again electrifying. It's a bit all over the park. Big hands on the ball a couple of times. And winning that line out at the front as well in an Argentina throw. Julian Montoya on for captain Agustin Crevy, that change made at half time. Back it comes for Lambie with the drop goal attempt. He turns straight away, he loves it, and has added another three. Nice to live in Northamptonshire. What a, what a way to retire, though, isn't it? If, uh, if he can get to that final and win it. True legend of the game. One experienced player to bring on when you're up against it in the in the semi-final. Kick of some importance. Not that you will have known it on the face of Pat Lambie. Nerves of steel. That's a fantastic kick. He's been sat on the bench. Best part of six. Captain Strauss going over the top, finding De Allende. That was good. England were expecting the big men to come into play. Missed them all out. The wood went the beast. Willem Albert saw from the scourge of England. Peter Steph to Toy with the carry, then Page back to Lambie. Looks for the drop goal. And gets it. Another spot.
Had a bit of a wobble, but it got there. And...